You know, a lot of people don't understand how important a good trigger is, but just think about it. Your finger on that trigger is the last contact with the bullet before you take the shot. Timney triggers have always been my favorite, and over the next few weeks, we're gonna show you how easy and even fun it is to install one yourself at home. Hi, my name is Nate Moser, and I'm with Timney Triggers. We're gonna do an install today on one of the most popular rifles, the Ruger 1022. First, we're gonna take off anything on the rifle. We have this clamp here, it's keeping the barrel from coming out. We're gonna remove the clamp from the barrel. We're gonna put it in our handy dandy vise. There's only one screw that holds this stock on, so we're gonna pull the screw off. Loosen that up. Stock's coming off. Once you get the stock off, there's only two pins that hold this trigger in. Push them out. Pull out your factory trigger and reinstall your Timney 1022 for the Ruger. Two pins back in. That easy. Put your stock back on. As your stock's on, function check it. It's all good to go.